welcome to today's vlog. So I'm putting my shoes on. It's Friday night. We're gonna go out to eat. I just ran upstairs. I finished almost all of my Monday orders, so that means I can take Sunday off again. Are you a real princess? Oh my gosh. Let me see it. Oh my gosh, yes, it's gorgeous. It's not yours, it's for grandma. Is that for grandma? Yes, do you think she will, do you think she will be happy, girl? She will be happy. With this picture? Yeah, she sure will. Okay. It's so beautiful. I would write it down here. Okay. I would set it right here. Okay. Hey guys, it's late night, Pam in her work room, I'm actually putting a bow on an order, I probably should have done this earlier, but I procrastinated, you guys ever do that? I just don't like putting bows on tutus, I just don't, it's like, why do I even bother? That's why I have like a couple that don't have bows on them and I love them. Because once you sew the ribbons on and you get it all together, it's done. Anyway, so we ended up going to Fuji for dinner. Um, I didn't vlog very much today because my grand plan was to get all of my Monday orders done. So that way... Um, if we go to the lake or something on Sunday, I won't have to work on orders. But, I got all but one. All but one. Um, and the only reason I didn't do that one is because I'm, I don't know. You ever have designs you just don't like to stitch out? I mean, sure it was fun creating it, but then you realize, gosh, there's a lot of steps in this one. And a lot of, I guess, you know, yeah. It's a, um, it's this one. If I think about it, I'll put the picture up here so you guys can see it. But it's this one. And it's not like, I don't know. I guess it would be harder if I had, um. Uh, the PE 770 you know what I mean and it went slower but still at the same time I have to hunt all those fabrics because I don't even remember what fabrics I used but yes I will either um, I don't think we're doing anything tomorrow so um, I don't know if I'll work or not I mean I don't have to but if I do, I might just make that and then that way I don't have to worry about working on Sunday. But I also kind of want to get some of my other order, you know what I mean, stay on top of everything because I've been doing really good. And then they implemented that star rating on Etsy, which annoys me. So I am very, very keen on answering messages. Like I am very up to it. I am like right on it. You know what I mean? When people message me, I like to message them back. I like to do that just because number one, if it's something I don't want to do, I want to tell them I don't want to do this. So they're not waiting around for me to answer them. You know what I mean? And I'm okay to tell people, no, I can't do that, or I don't think I can do that, or, you know. Um, but if, you know, if it's something, like, I've gotten two messages already t this evening, and both of them needed their order by the same date. Both of them. They're like, if I order today, will I get it by the 28th? What happened here? And so, if they ordered 
today, which is Friday, um, their order would ship out on the 20th. So, you know, it has eight days to get to them. So I'm pretty sure they'd get it. So I just said, yes, if you order today, you'll get it by the 20th. Or it'll ship out the 20th. That's what I said. So, anyway, long story short, my message response rate is what shocked me. It, like, totally shocked me. Um, it was like at 60 something percent, but now it's moved. Okay, so my message response rate is 76 percent. When I first looked at it, it was like 60 something percent, like 68 percent or something, 69. No, I think it was 68. I think so. Anyway. Which, I'm like, why is this, why is this so low? You know what I mean? I don't know. I think a lot of it has to do with, I get a lot of spam mail. Yeah. I do. Yeah. Yeah, I do. So when I get spam mail, I just, you know, I move it to the trash and I don't respond to it. So, yeah, yeah that could be it, huh? Mm -hmm. So now I have to remember, when I get a spam message, I need to mark it spam. I get a lot of, I guess because I'm on YouTube, I don't know. I don't know. Does everybody else get a lot of spam mail in their Etsy? I get a lot of questions about YouTube stuff. I get questions about, you know, I saw you on YouTube. Um, I try to respond to everybody because, you know, I feel like, you know, you took the time out of your day to message me. But I do get a lot of like um, spam journey. That's my stuff. A lot of like I just I just had one and I marked it as spam. It was something about um, we something about we love what you do. We're looking for more vendors at our craft thing. Something something. And the place it was at is like not even, I won't say it's not in my area, but it's, it's like way down by Columbia, which is a few hours away. So it's like, um, no, I'm not going to do that. I'm putting those on this tutu. Oh, thank you so much. And this girl is still awake because that's journey for you. Oh, will you hand me that? I know she's tired. She took a little nap. Hey, hey, hey. No, 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 no. That's somebody's order. Give it to me. I'm trying to put it on. <sighs> Mommy made you one. What'd you do with it? I don't know. I want to wear it. What kind of birthday party you want to have? On a birthday. What kind? On a birthday. What's funny? Like my big dress. Like a big cat like this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you want to have a, you want to have a ball? Mm -hmm. She wants to have a princess birthday party so she can dress up in a big gown. And she wants to have a ball. <laughs> so, I think what we're just going to end up doing is just doing like a little princess dress up kind of party for her. Because the girl, that's all she cares about right now is dressing up. She has worn her Easter dress out. Like she wore it out. Like like worn out. Like it's getting tattered and just falling apart. And um, so she definitely got our money's worth out of her Easter dress. Because... She's worn it to church a few times. Now it's like a princess dress. And then her sister found some stuff in the attic. And there was actually one of her sister's old dresses that she had in her dress up stuff, which was pink. What's wrong? You put your, what? You hurt your eye bad? What'd you hit it on? Huh? Oh my. Mama, sweet girl, I'm so sorry. Oh, 
Just lay your head right here. Just keep it close for a minute. Okay. Just keep it closed. It's okay. Did you poke it? Oh, my love. Are you my princess? Huh? You're not my princess? I thought you was. We have gone like, I don't know, I lost count now. I think it's like eight or nine days without a PACI. Mm hmm. You've been doing good. Mm hmm. Journey always smells so good. I still have to wash her baby, her baby, her clothes and baby laundry. So. Because she's allergic. Um, she's even allergic to some baby laundries, baby soap. We tried, um, when we went to Michigan on vacation, we tried to wash her clothes with our clothes, with our soap, and it was all free, clear and free. And she kept saying she was itchy, 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 so itchy, so itchy. So I bought a Meyer brand baby laundry soap and washed her clothes in that. And when we got back, we continued to use up the last of it and she was complaining she was itchy, itchy, itchy. There is. I just found it right there. What did you find? A car is right there. Right? We just want them. Oh, man. Is that what she was looking for? <laughs> she had me pack her purse earlier. She couldn't fit everything in her purse, so she wanted me to pack it up and put it in there for her. And so... She said she was missing a cup. But anyway. I'm going to hot glue these. But yeah, my message response rate is 76%. My five-star five rating is 96%, which, I mean, you can't control what people rate you. Mom, it hurts again. Your eye? Mm -hmm. Okay, well, let me finish this so I can package this up, and then we will snuggle. Pick out a book. Pick out a couple books for us to read. Anyway, I am going to end the vlog. I know I didn't vlog that much, but I'm going to end it and I will um, show you guys. Okay, go sit it next to the bed. We'll read that one. Pick out another one. Um, I will share with you guys what I made tonight because I felt like creating princess book. That sounds good. Um, I know everybody probably has their back to school stuff out by now, at least you should, but some schools don't start back until after Labor Day, which is um, like in Michigan. And that's when Sterling's gonna start back too. So there's still time, you know, if people want to order back to school stuff, there's still time. So I'm still making some back to school stuff because, yeah, because I want to add, you know, I like to add to my shop every year, you know what I mean? Like more Christmas stuff, more Thanksgiving stuff, more back to school stuff. So I'm going to probably make a few more. I've got a few more back to school designs in mind that I want to do. So I'm going to do them. Maybe they'll sell next year. But um, one is right here. I'll show you. You ever have like ideas just come to you and that's how this one came about. Is I already have this design. I already have, I already make a shirt that says this. 
but I wanted something bright. I wanted something just Mama, like, just bright. So, um, I just, I did it on scrap. So that way I was, I was going to do it on an actual shirt for journey, but I don't have anything that would fit her. I have a size 40 like shirt from, um, um, this is a 12 month and it's so cute. It's so full and fluffy. Um, a shirt from Hobby Lobby, a 4T, one of theirs, plain shirts. But I held it up to her. I'm like, um, no, even if it shrunk a size, it would still be too big for you. So, um, I just made it on that. Plus, she's got so many <clears throat> school shirts, even though she's not even in school, that I have made. And she won't even wear embroidery stuff, so. But I made a lot of them a little bit bigger, so that way maybe. Like, this is a 4T for animals. Like, maybe she'll, you know, get over whatever it is that she doesn't like to wear embroidery and start wearing it. But I'm going to package these up, and I'm going to head to bed. I made this one, too. Another 4T. Is it a 4? No, this is a 3T. This one will actually fit her. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Welcome to today's vlog. I like open. your shirt. We're at the Goodwill. Oh. What is this one? Oh, I like that one. I like this. I might get it. Hold on. Oh, what's this one? <gasps> That's spooky. This one is a fat quarter. Let's see. I like this one. It's cute. Okay. Scan this. So this is what I ended up picking out. So I got two of these ones. Have a seat. Kiwi? Have a seat. Okay. I've got you a surprise. You gonna keep your eyes closed? Okay, keep them closed. I was gonna wait to give it to you, but I guess I'll give it to you right now, okay? You're Keep them you're close. Right. Okay, hold on. Hold out your arms. I know what you're talking about, right? Okay, open them. Yeah, you wouldn't use a different. I wouldn't use a different color. Baby, baby one. Yeah, you got me What is it? It's a dot. It's a doctor's mom. Is this the doctor's? Mm-hmm. <gasps> Open it. Go show daddy. He's gonna be so surprised too. Open it. He's gonna see. Hey guys. Ooh, look at that hail. Crazy. So I'm like in there editing a vlog and stuff. And my husband comes in there. Hey. Let's go get ice cream. So, we're gonna go get ice cream. <laughs> what? Oh, no, 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 no. You eat it, baby. Is it yellow? Hey, guys. I'm trying to get you guys set up here. There we go. So, ice cream was delicious. And now, well, I placed an order with Angela a few days ago, and I got it like yesterday. So, I needed more mint 
green ribbon. I actually needed, I don't know what colors, honestly. Um, I know mint, I was almost completely out of mint green ribbon. Luckily she had mint, she had blue. And then, um, yeah, so I just ordered mint and blue. And then I know I needed more gold and then this pastel glitter one. I use this one on the, um, this one on the unicorn. So I just ordered more um, just to keep me from running out. And let's see what it was yesterday at Target. Um, I needed one of these. I needed 18 month onesies. Specifically, I need it for an order. And they didn't have any in the Carters. I, I like to use the Carters just when you. And so, um, these are dirty. I didn't even notice that. Oh my god. I normally don't wash my onesies unless I have to. Because I like for them to be new. But there's like something on this one here so I'll probably wash that one um, if I do wash them I wash them with Journey's baby laundry soap which is all I think it's all baby the one for a baby that's made by all um, so yeah I will wash that but what I'll normally do is I will just does that one look dirty too? I can't tell I can't tell if it's just the light a shadow I don't think it is does that look dirty? But you can tell in the light that looked dirty up here maybe not anyway um, yeah what I normally will do is just like wait until I have a few of them to wash and then wash them just by themselves nothing else in there with some of her detergent and then once they are done I just hang them up to dry I don't put them in the dryer so but Target didn't have any 18 month onesies but I did pick up 12 months because I know I was getting low on those um, I did start ordering some of the ones with them the one just like Cavio has, um, but from Angela. This one? No, that's a regular one from Cavio. That one, the, the sunflower neck. These ones. So this one is from Cavio. This is the sunflower neck, and um, and so I started ordering. I have some in twelve and eighteen months still. But since I don't actually advertise them as it being that style, um, I usually will ask if it's okay. And sometimes they say yes, sometimes they say no. So some people just don't like them. Anyway, when I was at um, Target, I did find these 18 month Gerber organic ones and these ones were on clearance they had a bunch of them on clearance they were $6.99 I normally don't use the Gerber because personally I didn't like them um, but these organic ones I think are really nice I mean the other Gerber ones I know they were like kind of ribbed looking you know what I mean like they had the ribs in them and so that's why I always went with Carter's and plus Carter's felt a little thicker but these ones are actually pretty pretty similar the organic but I didn't want to send them a like if I say in the listing because some of my older listings do say I might use Gerber or Carter's depending on the availability availability at the time of making and so I don't I'm not sure if this um listing says that or not so I did pick these up just because they were on sale clearance for there's five of them because I thought even if I don't technically use them 
Um, I'm still getting five. I can still make five samples of something on this, if that makes sense. Um, you can buy the the sheet of sheet. You know what I mean. Cut of fabric, oh, like I did. What I do with it, guys? Oh, right here. Like I did for this. You know what I mean. And I don't remember how many you can get off from that, but off from one yard. Um, but it just saves you a shirt and you have your picture but let's say you wanted to create something that you wanted to put with a tutu so you want to have it on some type of a shirt so you can put it on your mannequin with a tutu so usually I make stuff for Jern um, back in the day I'd make stuff for Sterling but you know Jern doesn't really wear embroidered stuff even though she's going to be turning four anyway, but I should see if she'll wear this shirt. Unless I get a three, a size 3T third birthday for a journey. But at Walmart today, I did pick up these. So they are the Carter's brand. But this one is the child of mine instead of only one you. So I will use those for that order. And then I got the fabric, which I showed you at the store. Which is got two of these I like to pick up two because they were just four forty four a yard so I'm like I'm buying two yards for 888 you know what I mean so um, I'm gonna run it through real quick and then I'm going to make something I don't know why